Ladies and gentlemen, what is equity? Is equity treating everyone in exactly the same way? Is equity when everyone is satisfied? To me, equity cannot be measured in facts and figures. Equity is something to do with one's heart, and that is something others cannot change. If I ruled the world, I would want everyone to be as equal as possible. This does not mean making them clones of each other, because everyone was created differently, created to be unique. However, if I ruled the world, what I could do would be change their actions, because I could not change their hearts. And by changing their actions, by making laws, their hearts would be easier to change. By equity, I do not only mean individual equity, I mean the equity of cities, countries, and even continents as a whole. I would want everyone to be able to go anywhere in the world and be amazed by how intriguingly unique each place was, yet how amazingly equal the living standards were very high. But how? How can all nations be equal? The answer is sacrifice. Developed countries need to sacrifice for developing countries. But we people are greedy creatures who care first about ourselves. Why should we give to others if we have nothing to gain out of it? Except there is something to gain out of it. Just not something for one person alone. And that something is the greater good. The good of the world we live in. Take the example of the reunification of Germany in 1990. It was post-war Germany. While the West had moved on, the East hadn't made too much progress. But the West couldn't just leave the East like that, could they? No. If Germany were to become better, it would have to become better as a whole. So the West sacrificed. They allowed the East to integrate with them. This meant that anyone could come into the West without a visa. This caused the West a lot of trouble, at least in the beginning. They had to give up resources. So why did they take so much trouble? Well, it's pretty simple. They knew that at the end of the day, if they were going to secede well, they would have to secede together. Now, West Germany had every right to ignore the problems occurring in East Germany. But they didn't. And now, look at Germany. Their economy is still going strong, despite the burden they had to go through in the reunification. And more importantly, they are together. And that is the way things should be, from the furthest east to the furthest west of the world. Now, I've gone on for ages about equity, but you must want to know what actual laws I'd lay down as the ruler of the world. Well, just like east and west of Germany, I'd want every nation of the world to merge together. Think about it. One set of laws, one government, 